All right, this is how to build your chest without using weights, okay? Without using the, the traditional free weights, okay? You can build your chest beautifully right in the comfort of your own home, all right? So we're doing it live, here we go. So first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna start off with the lower chest, all right? After we hit the lower chest, we're gonna go to the middle of your chest. After we hit the middle chest, we're gonna do the top part of the chest, all right? Because you have different muscle fibers, all right? You have to hit different exercises to target all of those specific areas, all right? So I just wanted to show you live on how is done, all right? So the first one we're gonna do, we will start off with the decline presses using the Toro Band, okay? I'm a big supporter of the Toro Band. Why? Because they're strong, durable, uh, indestructible. The handles are slip resistance, all right? Plus combined, they give you, I mean, a lot of tension, over 250 pounds um, of combined resistance, okay? So the Toro Bands, are the best to build muscle. So let's go start off with the lower chest. All right, here we go. Ah, good. Okay, so that was one set. I'm gonna do four sets before I move on to the next one. The most important thing, as you saw when I was doing a set, you want to be, you want to go heavy, okay? Um, and then the next thing you want to do is you really want to squeeze and flex your chest when you press on the bottom of the movement. So don't do this. This, that's not doing anything for you, okay? This is what you should do. Let's go. Because it's at the bottom of the movement that your chest really get that full contraction, okay? Um, and if, see, I'm using 70 pounds, and 70 pounds is not that heavy for me. I just wanted to show you. But you can double these weights, okay? There's a 60 pounds or 40 pounds, so you can double the weight up. All you have to do is you take an extra band, you hook it on there, and clip it on there, and you have more tension, okay? For right now, this is what I'm doing. Let's go, this is set number three, okay? And I'm doing six reps, all right? That's set six. Ah. So that's six reps, four sets, so I have one more set and then I'll go to the next one. Now, as far as rest, me personally, I like to rest just enough to make that burning sensation go away and then jump right back on it. So, you know what, let's go. So that was four sets. So I'm gonna do another decline exercise, okay, for the lower chest. This time I'm gonna do one arm. Now truly this would be 70 pounds in one arm, okay? So all I'm gonna do is take one of these off, all right? And then this extra hook, I'm just gonna clip it right on there, see? It clicks right on there. So now I'm doing 70 pounds with one arm, okay? So there's different things that you can do to create tension for your chest and that's how you build a nice, firm, big chest, all right? So same thing, one arm, let's go. 
this time it's going to challenge the muscles more and also challenge all the stability too of my muscles to make this work let's go ah you want to use your legs plant your feet and plant your legs that way the band doesn't torque you back okay because this is heavy let's go ah. do both sides. You don't want to be lapsided. Let's go. You know what? This side is already rested, so I'm going to go back and do it again and keep going back and forth until I get four sets. So that was one complete set. Let's go. Set number two. We got this. Ah. Let's go. Nice solid base. Set number three. Let's go. See, that's how you build your lower chest. See, it's working everything on the bottom. Okay, let's go. One, strict form. Okay, your technique. You shouldn't be wobbling all over the place, okay? It's slow and controlled, watch. See, it's a deliberate movement. Two, let's go. Three, let's go. Four, let's go. Five, let's go. Ah, right on the bottom of the chest. So let's switch. This would be our fourth one, okay? This is a 20 minute, it should take you about 20 minutes to get a complete chest work, all right? Let's go. And if you want more tension, you take an extra band, okay? You can take an extra band and loop it on there and you will get all the tension you want. So you can build your entire body in the comfort of your own home. Yes, the gym is good, but you really don't need weights. You don't need the gym, okay? If you're doing things correctly, guess what? You can build it up. So let's move on to the next one. That was four sets, two exercises. So now, <clears throat> I'm just going to leave that there. Now we're going to go to the middle of the chest, okay? Mid chest. Middle of the chest. Okay. This is straight presses. Okay, now first one I did was pushing down. This one is pushing parallel to the floor. So my arms are literally going this way. Like that. Okay, and that gets and develop the middle of your chest. Okay, once we do four sets and hit all the middle chest, then we're gonna go to upper chest, all right? So, 
no music today, okay? Use your mind as your music, okay? As long as you're doing things correctly, all you need is willpower in your mind, all right? So this is the middle chest, all right? Keep your body nice and straight. As you're pressing, your upper body should not be moving all over the place, no. Stay nice and stable right here. Ah, see that? Like that. Three, four, five, six. Good. Okay. So that weight is really, really light for me. Uh, that's 60 pounds. I really need to use a lot more. So that was one set though. So I'm just gonna take the extra 40 pounds and loop it in this way and just feed it. And what I like to do is make sure the bands are even before I attach it. That way the tension is, is the same on both sides. See, they're even, they're even. Then I take one, I attach it here. See that? Attach. I take the other and I also attach that piece here. So that creates more tension. So I've been getting a lot of questions. I'm not feeling it. Use more weight. Create more tension and that's how your muscles are going to grow. Okay. So I added 40 more pounds to what I was doing. So now I have 100 pounds. Okay. And I still have a lot more to add. So if 100 pounds is too easy, guess what I'll do? I will add 80 more pounds and trust me, my chest is gonna be on fire. So let's go, set number two. Ah, make sure that when you start, you have a solid base under you. That way your body is not going back and forth, okay? Let's go, six reps. Ah, that's much better. Two. Three, four, five, ah, six, short rest, let's go, wow, one more. Ah, that's set number two. Two to go. Short rest. Set number three on deck. Set number three. Ah, it start to burn. Now, when it start to burn, what do you do? Let that willpower and you let your heart kick in, okay? Because your mind is much stronger than your body. And like David Gargan would say, when you get to a point where you are completely fatigued, you've only done forty percent. Let's go. Squeeze it. Five, six, two more. Ah, one more. Ah, that was three. We got one more to go, folks. Let's go. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think what's happening, what's going on, what you're struggling with. If you need any help on specific forms or exercise, give me a shout and I always reply to all of you. All right, let's go, last one. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Ah, oh, that was four sets, nice. 
we just getting started. Now, I'm going to make it a little challenging. We're going to take both sides of the band, combine it in one arm, okay? So once again, I will take off the handle, take that off. I'm going to combine all on one. So now, that, that's a hundred pounds off of one arm like that. It's going to fire up the middle of your chest, plus you're working all of your core muscles. Why? Because you have to use your core muscles to keep you balanced. All right? Let's go. We're doing four sets, and we're going to go back to back, back to back, back to back. So six, 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 until we get four sets. Let's go. Ah. Woo! Ah. Last one. Last one. One more on the other arm. Here we go. four sets so now heart rate is up muscles are pumping we got 30 seconds to rest and then we're gonna do another exercise okay so now what we're gonna do we will do same position, all right? We're gonna do butterfly off the same position. So now, I'm gonna take the two off, okay? Take the two off. I'm gonna throw the handles back on. Throw the handle back on. Handle back on. Now we're gonna do butterflies. All right. Whoops. Uh, woo! Saved by the mic. All right. Let's do the mic back on, and we will be ready to go to exercise. Okay. Let's go. These are chest flies. Okay. So what I like to do, I like to start, this is the start. You want to open it up like a half circle. So when you open it, don't go like this. Your elbow should be lined up like that, okay? Not here. So here, you start here, you open it nice and wide, close it. Mm. That's how you build that chest. Two of oh, six, three, open. Four, open, five, 
open, six. Set number two. Mm, start here. This is the starting point. One, two, three, four, five. Ah, that's set number two. Short rest, we're ready to go again. That was third. That was the third set, I believe. Yeah, third. Let's go. Ah, six. So that was four sets. So now we're going to change gears and we're going to hit that upper chest. All right. So let's change gears. Oh, let's change gears. You know what I'm going to do? Yeah, let me just take this off. Let me take that off. And I'll show you a cool way to work your upper chest, okay? Let me just take these handles off real quick. I'm just gonna use one band, okay? I'm gonna use one band. So now, I'm gonna step my foot inside, put that in the floor. I'm gonna turn my palm up to the ceiling and I'm gonna raise my arm. I'm not doing a bicep curl, so it's not this. It's raising my arm up like a caterpillar like that. See it like that? And when you do that, it hits your upper chest. All right, let's go. That's one set. Build those pecs. That's two sets. We're almost done. Keep it going. Woo! Switch it. Uh, that was three sets. Let's do one more and we'll be done. Woohoo! Ah. 
So. That's how you build your upper chest, all right? So hopefully this live video has been helpful to you because um, I want all of you as my subscribers, men and women, to improve and get better. So we're going to be doing more live interaction videos, okay? My name is Chancey. Smash that subscribe button. Peace and love, and I will catch you on the next one.